Welcome back, beautiful beings. Today, I wanted to give you an idea. Very low on embellishments. I have candy here. And there's wrappers on them. Okay, this is National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation Double Crisp. <laughs> well, you can keep the wrappers and you can glue them. I'm just using Great Value Butter, okay? All you do is take the wrapper, be careful to unwrap them so you don't create more wrinkles because there's already wrinkles in the foil. And then just follow the circle and cut them out. Some of them don't have circles, but most of them do. Getting all the green off. If you want to make them bigger, you can. You can leave some green on. What oh, didn't have a circle? This one didn't have a circle, so I did my very best and cut it in a circle form. And then you just take your little cutout. This is the house from the movie. And then just glue it down. And I still have some of these drying. Okay, beautiful beings. And remember, these don't have to be Christmas ones, okay? They could be anything. They can even be magazines, whatever you want, okay? And then just cut it out. And just to make sure, just to make sure that the wrapper stays down on the cardboard we're going to use some i'm using this is winter white multi-surface but i'm using different colored glue different colored paints to go around them then i'm going to let them all dry and this just seals the aluminum more aluminum foil to the cardboard so you don't have to worry about them falling apart, okay? I thought they'd make cute embellishments. Not everybody, but most people like this movie. Just put that around like that. Then let it dry. Just make sure you got it on the edges really good, okay? All the way around where they meet. Where the cardboard meets the loom foil, okay? And that should hold them together if the glue fails to. Okay? I'm gonna paint these all up and I'll be back when they're all dry. Okay, beautiful beings, I got half of a cup sleeve. And I'm gonna show you what you can do with these. I'm just gonna make a pocket out of them to show you, okay? I'm thinking I might rip this a little bit because I kinda want that groove in there. I don't know if the groove will show up. See, I didn't get the effect I wanted over here, like I did over here, because I put too much glue down. I haven't done this in a while, so I forgot how to do it. But I remembered. I'm gonna pull this back, put a little glue in there, and push that in with my nail. Same here, a little glue, and push that in so it glues down nicely with my nail. Now I'm thinking snow. Thick and snow, so 
So I'm gonna need glitter or something else. So let me think, hang on. Okay, beautiful beings, I got some of these. Just those, and I'm just gonna put them down. Where I ripped the things, okay? Well, I ripped the wrapping paper. how that looks so far and I'll be right back okay beautiful beings I have this bag of fox snow from the Dollar Tree that I want to open and then I got this nice sauerkraut jar nice round and I'm gonna pour that in it we made sauerkraut for New Year's Eve any of you guys make sauerkraut for New Year's Eve? <laughs> and just the pouring out part, I got it on a white piece of paper. I'm gonna put some glue down. I'm gonna put it like beside, I think. I don't know how good this is gonna stick, but I'm gonna dip it. I'm just gonna dip it in a jar. And whatever sticks to it, sticks to it. Put some here around there and I'm gonna dip it in the jar again okay do the same thing and swirl it around on it like that I might want more up there, I'm not sure. See how much took. Just enough. And then I'm gonna put this side back in to see if anything else will take on that end. And then I'm gonna leave this to dry. And I'm gonna leave that to dry. Give me a close up. And I'll be back. Okay, beautiful beings. It's dry, and all I did was go around this with a metallic marker, and then I went around it again with a chalk marker, okay? And I'm thinking, there. Let's get that out of the way. And I want to show you this too. <clears throat> Magnets from Crafter Square, the Dollar Tree. You get 12 of them. Take one. And just glue it on the back and boom. You got a magnet for your fridge or office or wherever. Wherever you want. Wherever you want. But magnets will work. Okay, so I'm gonna take that and glue it there, and I think I want him like up here. And then of course I want the house, but I want a different color house. I want the greenhouse. I think I want the greenhouse. Let's see. It's just Christmas paper again. <laughs> now, I saved a lot of stuff for my Christmas papers through the years because I didn't have a lot of craft stuff. So, but it works. It really works. I'm just gonna stick glue here and there. And I want that right there, I believe, like that. I want it straight though.
I'm gonna put some glue on here. Oh, and then I forgot to tell you, for the magnets, if we're gonna make magnets, I would take glue and go around the edges. That way, if they get knocked off, the refrigerator, you don't get dinged up, okay? So I just take some glue, any glue. You can kids glue, Elena's, Maj Baj, and just go around the edges. So if they get knocked off, because you know stuff gets knocked off the fridge, and you don't have to worry about it. And there's our pocket. And this stuff, I mean, some of it's coming off, but it did take very good. Okay, of course you're gonna have little crumbs falling off, but it really, it did take good. And here's the pocket, and then I'll give you a close up of all these. And I got left over for another pocket. Hopefully, I just went around them with white, silver, and gold. And red. Some red, not many. Red and green. Okay. That's what they look like. And you can even put snow around them if you want. You don't have to use paint. Just something that seals those together. Okay. Have a wonderful everything.